Hey loves, um, I just want to come y'all real quick with a quick um, Q and A. Um, I have my notebook, and I'm kind of being quiet because my daughter is in the room sleep. But yeah, my daughter is in the room sleep, so we're just gonna get right into the video. What is psoriasis? Leaky psoriasis is a leaky gut syndrome. Um, it comes from the gut, excuse me y'all, it comes from the, um, the, the pores in the gut, I guess you could say pores for gut, but anyways, I'm not like a doctor or anything, I just want to point that out, but I'm not like a doctor or anything, but this is what I got out of it, but, um, the, the gut has little holes in it or whatever and like the basically the types of food that you eat like over the years they be, they make the the holes in the gut become larger so the food that wasn't able to come through the gut is now able to pass through the gut and get into the bloodstream so once it's now into the bloodstream um now it's like your body is sending the signals to fight against it so like is fighting against something that's not supposed to be there or whatever. So that's how it ends up making the thick scales, the thick plaques on my scalp and on my other places on my body. So um, how long have I had it? I've had it going on maybe 10 years now. Um, does my children have it? No, my child does not have it. But coincidentally, my husband does have a form of psoriasis. He has eczema. Um, what do I do for my psoriasis? Um, I do a lot of hot oil treatments. I do a lot of um, scratching. I do, um, I bathe with, uh, I have now hemp soap and I used to do like uh, black soap, African black soap. I use shea butter. I do um, oatmeal baths. They really, really like oatmeal baths is like heaven for me. Um, and I use Dove sensitive skin. Um, it's a lot of stuff that I'm learning more and more to help my psoriasis. And I have a big announcement at the end of the video, y'all. It's crazy. What is the main thing that's helping my psoriasis? Um, have I seen a doctor for it? Yes. Yes, I have seen a doctor for my psoriasis. But one thing, I really don't like going to the doctor for my psoriasis. I mean, I don't mind going to the doctor, but I don't like them to prescribe me medicine for my psoriasis because I feel like it's it's really to help them it's not really to help the patient that's just how I feel about it my that's my honest opinion about it um they can make it the medicines that they give you it makes it look like it's healing you but it's not really healing you it's just like destroying your body even more so that's why I just like I don't really like going to the doctors. I'll go, I'll still go to the doctors for like checkups and stuff, but as far as them prescribing me medicine for my condition and stuff, I just I'm not cool with it. Um, and that's another another thing, a part of the big announcement. Y'all just stay to the end. Just stay to the end. Um, how long after a scratch does it come back? Um. I would say maybe if I don't do a hot oil treatment, it will come back immediately after I wash my hair. Like I will still have some, some of those plaques still on my scalp. Like they won't come off until I do a hot oil treatment. But if I do a hot oil treatment, it'll say probably come back like three days, three days after I wash my hair. Um, next question. Do you have psoriasis anywhere else on your body? Yes. As you can probably see, I have some psoriasis on my eyelid right here. I don't know if y'all can see that or not, but it's some psoriasis right here on my eyelid. And I have psoriasis sometimes on my forehead. Um, some It's a spot right here on my elbow. A spot right here on my, um, on my arm right here. Um... I have psoriasis on my back. It's like a big, really big patch on my back. Y'all know I have it behind my ears. And I have it some other places I can't tell y'all. But anyways, um, next question. 
um, what do I do to wash my hair with? Um, I wash my hair with now y'all know I use um, some of y'all know that I use um, hemp soap I just tried that hemp soap which I like actually better than a black soap which is what I've been using I've been using the black soap I've tried Castile soap I've tried um, Selsun blue I've tried um, I've tried a lot of different soaps, but the only two main effective ones that I've tried that I really like is either black soap or hemp soap, which I like the hemp soap best because it doesn't burn. It doesn't make my scalp burn at all. Um, what well, next question? Okay, I'm going to address a, a couple of comments that you guys have made. Okay, so as far as the video that I had did the ears face and um the ears face and what was it eyebrow it was face and forehead or something i posted right here i'll post a picture of it right here but that video a lot of y'all said that i stopped washing my face and stopped taking care of my skin just to make a video no and that's another thing that's gonna tie into the um the big announcement that i have um, just not washing my hair and taking care of my skin just to make a video. I will wake up every single day with my skin just like that. Every single day. And it was because, for one, my eating habits were horrible. Two, it was winter time, which made it so much horrible. And other things to, like, help my skin. And I just, like, at that at that season, in that season, my skin was just, like, so bad because of the, um, because of the weather. Um, I have to address the, uh, copyright video that somebody decided to take my video and upload it as their own. And I said something to them about it and they just didn't care. And I, I, I know they didn't care because a lot of, a lot of you guys went on there and said, okay, you're still in Tatiana's video. But then later on, he disabled the comments so that's telling me like you stole my video and you don't care and you're gonna keep it up there so that's basically saying like um i'm gonna stole i'm just gonna keep this video and i'm gonna make this money off of this because he only he already got like what 500 600 subscribers off off of my videos like when i first saw the video he only had like maybe 300 subscribers now he has like over 500 so basically he's using my videos to get his money. Wow. But yeah, he's gonna those are gonna get taken down um soon. I can't report it um correctly because I need a um computer. My computer is acting up, so I, I have to like go to the library or whatever. But yeah, those are soon to get taken down. Um next thing I have to address. Oh, the religious, the religious part. Somebody made a comment on my um, last live where my husband was praying on the video and he was like saying scriptures and stuff. A lot of you guys said that you liked it, that said that you liked it, that he um, prayed and said a scripture on the video. But one of somebody subscribe a subscriber of mine said on here that. I was basically trying to do that just so I can get attention that the other scratchers aren't getting. Okay, so basically, my husband, he is always, that's how he is. That's just the type of person he is. My husband doesn't get into how many subscribers I have, how many views I get. He doesn't even look at all of that. His first mindset will always be give God glory first. That's what will always be his first mindset. So we're not looking at the fact that we're going to get views. First mindset will always be give God glory first. I don't know what made a person think that I was trying to bring God on our channel just to get views, just to get money. If that was the case, then I could have just made a whole channel just for God that doesn't make any sense to me. But anyway, next thing I have to address. So the big announcement, you guys. I am going vegan. Y'all, can y'all believe that? Can y'all believe that I'm going vegan? So um, 
as far as continuing the scratching videos, um, I guess they'll still be here. <laughs> we'll have to cross that bridge when we get to it. Um, I, I know I'm gonna have some 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 back slips and probably eat a burger or something like that. Eat something I'm not supposed to eat, so I probably will still have like flakes and stuff, but maybe it won't be as much and I won't have to deal with as much flakes and be as much miserable as I used to be. Um, so yeah, y'all tell me what y'all think about that. Oh, okay, my first giveaway y'all i'm so excited i'm gonna be giving away a hundred dollars to one of my lucky subscribers but you have to here are the rules you have to download cash out onto your phone or to your phone you have to be subscribed to this channel and my other channel is going to be linked in the description box so yeah y'all don't forget to do that um i'm gonna be excited because this is like my first giveaway and like before y'all know before for those of you who were um here subscribe to my channel before i like started getting my videos monetized i used to like not you know have the funds to like get the equipment that i needed and a lot of you guys supported me um to the end like y'all were like down for me like y'all were when people had bad comments to say about me y'all back me up y'all like my subscribers are like the freaking best like i love y'all like y'all just don't understand so i'm giving away a hundred dollars to one of my subscribers just make sure you get, download cash out and make sure you are subscribed to this channel and the other channel and like this video all right so y'all that's the end of this video make sure y'all just like this video and subscribe i love y'all